It's your EFA Weekly Report. Pat Emig here reminding you that next season starts today. Elite alumni have returned home to train in recent weeks. Coastal Carolina sophomore quarterback Dalton Demo stayed sharp inside the academy during his time away from school. Also training before he returned to Stillwater, Oklahoma, Oklahoma State wide receiver Brandon Shepard, as well as fellow EFA receiver and Michigan wideout Jehu Chesson. We spoke with Jehu's father recently and he said that training at Elite has given his son an edge with the Wolverines. I mean, what he's doing at college is what he's doing there, but I think you only get better if you train by yourself and keep continuing to train. And I think having Elite helping, working with him when he comes home really makes a difference. Michigan is ranked ninth in some preseason publications and the Wolverines are expecting big things from Chesson in 2013. In the NFL ranks, EFA alum Ben Garland is making the switch from defensive line to offensive guard for the Denver Broncos. And Garland is earning the high praise of head coach John Fox. Said Fox, he's smart, he's tough, I think he's got great willpower to succeed and so regardless of what position, Ben Garland is going to compete and do well. Also in the NFL, EFA coach Lamarck Brown is competing in organized team activities for the Minnesota Vikings. His play was highlighted by a 60-yard reception from Matt Castle. OTAs wrap up for the Minnesota Vikings in the middle of June. Also in the NFL, Rams defensive back and EFA coach Robert Steeples recently accepted his diploma from the University of Memphis, and he did so in grand style by imitating Neon Deion Sanders. Let's take a look. Robert Don't try that at home, kids. That's it for EFA Weekly. A reminder that Elite Football Summer Camp for the June and July session still open for registration. We leave you with highlights from the St. Louis Rams High School Player Development Camp held at Parkway Central. This was the camp put on by Elite Football Academy. We'll see you next week.